What's good, ladies and gentlemen of YouTube? J Daisy here with the J Daisy Gaming Channel. Here, back finally with Batman: The Telltale Series, Part Two, Episode Two. Um, it's been a while since. Uh, it's probably been about a month since the last one. Uh, that's what kind of sucks was playing this one as opposed to the last one we played, just because um, these are still coming out, so we have to wait in between. Um, if I remember right, we defeat the Riddler. Uh, but Amanda Waller somehow knows our identity. Uh, Gordon uh, is kind of perturbed at us. And that one chick, we made her lose her hearing. And uh, Lucius's daughter, we lied to her, but I think she trusts us. Um, so we'll uh, start episode two. It should recap here of what our last decisions were, but I think that's all I can... Those were the kind of the major points I remember... Anyways, yep, that it does. That it does. Hopefully the audio is good. Still trying to work out the kinks here with the new audio setup. So hopefully everything comes through. Did a couple different mic checks. So that water mist uh, appears to be water. We're still on the boat. We're on a boat last time. The madman from Gotham's past returned to terrorize my city. He drew me into his twisted game. Striking at the things I hold most dear. But I survived his deadly traps. I emerged the victor. But the cost was too great. Right. Lucius Fox is dead. Riddler is dead. And with him, the only lead I had to taking down the greatest danger Gotham has ever faced. And the person best equipped to help me is a threat to my deepest secret. The Riddler was going to be my way in once we captured him alive. But now I have you to lean on. A man who lives on both sides of the line and knows exactly when to cross it. Yes, you and I will be working together very closely. Bruce Wayne. First thing you need to know, I can keep your secret. And despite what you did, going behind my back to Mori, I will continue to keep it. Mm. No reports, nothing. No one else needs to know. To deal with the present threat, though, I need both of you. The man inside and outside the mask. You have to understand, I'm not the enemy here. I really it may seem that way right now, but I'm not. Our problems are far too big for us to be bickering among ourselves. Yeah. If that's true, then reinstate Gordon as commissioner. Hmm. You really are loyal to that stubborn <laughs> mule, aren't you? Yes, yes I am. I'll tell you what. Play nice with me now, and when this is all over, I'll make things right with Gordon. When Riddler's friends hear he's dead, they ain't gonna just carry on carrying on. They might get sloppy. They might want revenge. Or they might simply accelerate their plans. I'm gonna need eyes everywhere in Gotham. A man like Bruce Wayne, with all his influence and resources, can go places Batman can't. You understand what I'm saying, don't you? Your public persona could be a great help to us here. Maybe even as much as Batman in certain situations. I, think I know when to us? be Batman and when to be Bruce. It's the mask that fits best at the time. Tactical. Now you're speaking my language. Hmm. What the hell? <laughs> Looks like the whole city's under attack. We've got a report of a raid on the Gotham PD arsenal. Did those bastards get their hands on our weapons? This is coordinated. It's Riddler's gang. It has to be. We're gonna need Batman for this one. Agreed. No shit, Sherlock. Emergency services is already pushed to the limit. Well, then we'll have to redeploy patrol officers to defend the arsenal. Don't divert any men, Gordon. I can handle the arsenal call. Thank you. I like how Gordon still was commissioner when he's not commissioner. This anymore. is what we trained for. 
There's been an attack in the financial district. Biotech company on the west side is under siege. Still commissioning. -ing. Oh, those are bad guys. I was going to say, that looks pretty normal. Ooh, uh, yeah. Thank God all the ba bad guys look the same and carry the same guns. That's real convenient. <laughs> sneaky, sneaky. Thank God this place has Wayne Tech vents. Seven six. Why would, wouldn't they be using five five six? Wouldn't that be standard police issue? What? What more do you want with me? Hey, shut it! You got what you came for. You don't need me. Oh, you better hope that's not true. I'll live your usefulness, and the boss will make a pretzel out of your neck. And here we go. Hands on the keyboard, ready to go. Night night. Whoa. How many are there? I don't know. Ten or twelve, maybe. The really big one. He he made me give him the keys to the armored transport vehicles. I didn't want to. I swear. It's okay. Get out of here. I like how no one's seeing no. us. I Thank you. See them Batman. working in the background. <laughs> sneaky, sneaky. Hey, you about done? Yeah, yeah, just about. All right. And we'll go up. That sounds okay. Ah. Son of Shifty. Uh, shift Q. I think I hit it. Oh, who the hell is... Who's throwing people? Is this Bane? Who are you? A nightmare. Much like yourself. Oh, that's it. But you Bane. can call me Bane. Oh, shit. Hey. Bane grew a Fu Manchu, or a weird Fu Manchu thing. A man cannot win a war alone. You. You fight well, but you fight alone. You will die alone. This Bane's kind of pussy. Eat. <laughs> I chose to go after Bane. Ooh, shifty. I'm kind of mash buttons over here. Not gonna lie here, folks. I like how his mask kind of looks like I can see why Riddler wanted to be the one to kill you. Riddler is dead. He's dead. He got Riddler. You should be worrying about yourself. I promised my men a hell of a battle if ever I faced you. And I'd hate to disappoint them. Oh, I haven't faced a true warrior since I left Peña Duro. Here. Here's your man. Oh, oh no. Oh, don't break my back. I need that. Ooh, nice snarl. Save your strength, man. This one is mine. Oh, now you. Now you want to do one on me. Oh, hello. I like how he's just letting him do this. Uh, maybe not run at him. Yeah. I got nothing. I got nothing. I got no prompts. Shifty. Shifty. Oh. I will give you a piece for death. If you take it. Oh, yeah! Mike's back! Fuck yeah! Shift, whatever. Ooh. Don't forget Chip! Chip's dead. Oh, oh 
no. Not back. This pain you're feeling. Haha. <laughs> Ow. Oh. Just threw us. Oh. Fuck me. Pain's always going after arsons. Why was the blood kind of moving upward? You all right, boss? Did you get him? There is nothing to fear, my friend. Keep your eyes open. Don't let anyone follow you through the warehouse. Don't worry, we'll take the back way by the guards. Safe travels, my friends. Gordon knows the city better than anyone that you should be. Waller's people are well trained and equipped to deal with Bane's men and safely recover the weapons. But if Gordon is bound to feel betrayed, Waller will feel disrespected for suspending. You know what? Who You know who we're calling? <laughs> Gordon. <laughs> Batman? Batman, what's wrong? Jim. Hope. <laughs> Jim's our friend. Hang in there. Help is on the way. Oh no, my eyes. They're tied to my life sign. The eyes go out, we're dead. Good old chip. Hey, that was a good opening. So this Bane's got a weird Fu Manchu type thing going on. Cares a lot about his men. And speaks in contradictions. Yeah, I'm sure Waller will be <laughs> mad. Especially now Batman. that we're working together, but... You know what? Fuck it. Gordon's. Gordon's our man. Batman! Jim. Say something if you can hear me! Gordon. Christ. Batman. Come on, help me. It won't move! Batman. We're gonna need you to help us push this thing off you. Come on! You can do it! It's moving! Jesus there we go. Come on. The mechanic. Where is he? didn't make it. Talk. He saved my life. Batman? It's okay, Jim. I just need a minute. I got my ass handed to me. Well, when you're feeling up to it, I'd love to hear what the hell happened here. Uh, who did this to you? Some guy named Bane. He called himself Bane. His men loaded the weapons onto the APCs. Said they were taking them to a warehouse near the docks. Well, that doesn't narrow it you down. You need to find them. Don't worry. We'll catch the bastards. But you better believe the entire force is motivated after what happened tonight. These bastards declared war on our city. He's not going to like this. Be but... sure to loop in Waller. She can help you. I already did. Didn't have a choice. Now that Waller's my superior, I have to loop her into everything. I'm sorry, Jim. Maybe we can use her at least. Yeah, give us a second, will you? I don't. Is that one of her agents, or is that is that Thanks Martinez from the last game? The one that snaps. And... I need all the juice I can get now that we live in Waller's Gotham. We're going to have to stick together if we're going to weather her storm. You and me, we're nothing like her. We're men of principle, who still believe in the letter of the law. I will always have your back, Jim. Thanks. You're Batman. a good cop. You don't know how good it is to hear that. I like Jim. I mean, he's a shitty husband in the comics, but he, he's a Thanks good man. Thanks again for keeping me in the loop. 
It means a lot. See, I feel better that we picked him. Waller, she just... I can't trust anyone named America Waller. Right on time. I'll get to the Batcave. See if I can make some sense of what happened tonight. Oh, and here's so, Agent Black. what did I miss? Oh, I was at the scene of a heist at the Gotham Brokerage House when Batman called me here. What were they after? We're still getting a full account. Once the dust settles, I'll send you everything we've got. Detective Bullock's writing up a full report. I'll have him send you a copy. Officers are ready for your deployment orders. I've got to get going. Hi, Jim. How's it going, man? Your partner, Avesta. How is she? Still in the hospital. The doctors say the hearing damage could be permanent. Damn it, it should have been me. I failed her. <laughs> I put her in danger. It's my fault. Avesta's tough. A survivor. She'll pull through. See? Don't have to She's use been through a lot. I just hope this doesn't break her. It won't. Look, I owe you one for saving my life back there. So I gotta warn you. Waller flipped when she heard you called Gordon instead of her. Don't ever. You really should stay on Waller's good side for as long as you can. For everyone's sake. I'll tell Avesta you asked about her. Thank you. Why didn't we mention Bane to him? He might know who the hell Bane Alfred, is. Prep the med bay. We're going to need it. Just gonna, just gonna limp out of here. Episode two. The Pact. No, how would you? The Pact. The the Pact. I don't know how. No way you can say that. It sounds good. Bruce. Did Lucius die in the last one? Yeah, that was the one. I'm, I'm fine. No. Really? No, you're not. You are not fine, Bruce. There you go. <sighs> None of this is fine. You were nearly killed tonight. Those minutes of silence, waiting for you to respond, they were the worst of my life. Well, I didn't know if you were alive or dead, or if... if I would ever see you again. I'm so sorry to put you through that, Al. Why don't we'll we just do, do it again tomorrow. We did that yesterday. I put you through just silence. We already we lost Lucius. the Day cage. I couldn't bear losing you, too. Uh, uh, we, we can talk about all this later. Come on now. Let's get you patched up. not a good med bay. It's the same bay as every other bay. As if he wasn't bad enough, now Director Waller knows your identity. That information in her hands? Waller isn't the one we need to worry about. Bane is still on the loose, with enough guns to arm a small militia. Oh, I... I understand. The man died for you tonight, Bruce. Tried to save you from that monstrosity. Too many have died in too short a time. Poor the cost of this war, it just continues to rise. Alfred, we will get through this. You know that, right? Yeah, we'll use... The storm will pass. We'll use Gordon's yes, I, thing. I know that, Bruce, and I'm sorry for not being my resolute self. It's just this bane is terrifying. Yeah, We've never seen funny. this kind of destructive power before. Waller was right about one thing. Riddler was just a small part of a larger threat. Let's begin with the dart I pulled from his neck. <clears throat> Got it? I'm good, thanks. Oh. Big huh. claw. There's still some toxin left in here. What kind of toxin? Something new. There's a whole series of powerful psychoactive meds in this cocktail. Drugs that are lethal when combined. Who could have come up with such a concoction? And did the same person pull the trigger? 
Bane's attack was one of three tonight, all at the same time. Let's bring him up. Hey, that's Get an a, assessment a of the cold. damage. Let's look at this one. The one that's all covered in ice. Gothcorp Labs, genetic research facility. Where do we even start with this? Yes. I have no idea. Authorities can't determine what was even stolen until all of that melts. At least 20 dead, some completely encased in ice. The others were frozen solid. Some of their limbs shattered as they fled. Waller's intel shows that the thieves made off with numerous pieces of equipment used in the storage and transportation of biological material. I don't even want to think. I always what hate when they make Mister Freeze a villain. No like, ideas on any He's just a guy though. trying to keep his wife Security alive. Security cameras frozen. All witnesses dead. And, you know, I, I, I Mister Freeze is my second favorite supervillain, right behind Clayface. Clayface is still number one, followed right behind Gotham by Mister Freeze. Ten million in diamonds stolen. Some safety deposit boxes emptied. Contents unknown. Over a dozen dead, and even more wounded. Mostly by gunshot, though some victims had their heads smashed in. Well, that's barbaric. It's a lot of diamonds. Witnesses place Harleen Quinzel at the scene, dressed up as a clown and wielding a mallet. Don't ask me. Riddler's friends are as insane and gruesome as he was. Perhaps even more. Those same witnesses say that she acted alone. All that carnage. All by herself. I'm more impressed she got the safe open. Huh. Uh, Gotham Sisters back. GCTV, Batman, and. Uh, Wayne Enterprise stock hits record high. Uh, that's gonna be used against us. Dent trial date pushed back again. Gazelle investigate. <laughs> Gazette investigates. What is the agency? Oh, and then Codex. Just some stuff. I never was big on the Codex. You guys know that by now. Guns, money, biotech. What are they planning? We won't know until we get to Bane. You know the thing I like most about this I Alfred. I to cause offense. This is like. But you're in uh, no shape to beat the information out of that monster. Or take on his friends if it comes to it. He uh he sounds like the We've old... already seen how formidable Bane is on his own. Taking on all of them, that would be suicide in your current condition. Of course I could use help. But both the GCPD oh, he sounds and like the, the old nineteen sixties Alfred. Like one thing's for sure. We can't oh. just wait around for Bane to strike. Alfred again. is remembering that the we death need toll help. Is already too high. You told Waller you knew when to be Batman? And went to be Bruce. Riddler said his friends abandoned him at the Lady of Dublin. He alluded to the fact that John Doe was one of them. If that's the case, then John can get you close to the others. He did want us to meet his he friends. He wants you to meet them. John Doe might be your best chance of getting inside, finding out what they're up to. I'll have to repay John's trust with betrayal. You wouldn't have to betray him if he didn't associate with criminals. It'll be dangerous approaching Bane and his people this way. They'll be suspicious of anyone who isn't a proven criminal. You'll have to give the performance of a lifetime to pull the wool over their eyes. Bruce Wayne has influence, an endless bank account, and as of last year, questionable integrity. <laughs> Everything a criminal network looks for in a new recruit. So that's it then. I find John Doe and accept his offer. I really wish they would have put a big question mark. Tracking device on him when you had the chance. The stack deck. That's where he is. Hey, hey. I that's the. Uh, you if you watch the. While you rest. Uh. Not a chance. The Batman animated series. That was the the bar from the episode where they all share the stories of beating Batman. Croc and them. There's a card deck or a card game out there based on that episode. And I believe, Batman. if I remember right, it was called the Stack Deck. I'll no. tell you about Batman. He's no hero. The way I see it, he's just a bunch of hired muscle for rich guys. 
Guys, how are we gonna play Bruce off that we knew Wade. where he was? I see. Willie, tell Bruce Wayne how that makes you feel. Dude, uh, okay. It feels uh, no, Willie. He's on your right. It feels like crap, Wayne. Preach! And you're just a huge, colossal, gigantic, spoiled piece of. Sh oh, uh, <laughs> I am. Uh, <laughs> I mean, uh, I'm going to ignore what I heard. No harm done. <laughs> you set me up. Nonsense. Bruce. Uh, uh, don't mind Willie. We're just messing with you. You look like you could use a drink. Hmm. Man that talks to dolls, is he going to be the ventriloquist? Probably not, but, you know, maybe I'm looking for things. What about my medicine? Bottle's under my chair, Willie. Let the cat clown lead you to Bane, whatever it takes. Huh. I, uh, I run a therapy circle here every second Sunday. That's very noble of you. These people need the expertise that I learned in Arkham. There's a lot. What, what's going on here? Tracker, Bruce? Really? I was worried about you. you... <sighs> I gotta say, I'm disappointed. I thought we'd built more trust between us. I'm sorry. I'm sorry, John. All I could think of was getting to Riddler. You were my best chance. I... I should have just... Waited for me to get back to you? Like I said I would? Oh, is he gonna be mad? Please hey, don't... I said I was sorry. It's rude, duplicitous, oh. and kind of stalkery. But I understand. Oh. Okay. All is forgiven. That's eerie and open-ended. So This is just weird. That rude know-it-all really got what was coming to him. Authorities are refusing to comment on the death of the mysterious criminal known as Riddler. Who am However, I? Who am I? You're a rotting, stinking corpse. That's who you are. <laughs> oh, this Joker is just creepy. Did you have anything to do with the Riddler's death? I mean, I hated the guy, but... Jeez, Bruce. You really think I'd be capable of cold-blooded murder? Uh, several thousand. After everything you know about me, you really think I'd do that? No. No, 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 of course not. I mean, I know you hated him, but, you know, killer. What was I thinking? Uh, I know what you were thinking. But hey, no harm done. This is just creepy. Anyway. Also, the bar has no bar stools. So that's also creepy. To see you, Bruce. I'm guessing this is about that favor I asked. Yeah. You got an open Look, before we get Sunday into night. that, I need to come clean. Okay. You Riddler him. was more connected to my friends than I'd let on at the funeral. Riddler? Really? Yeah, he was kind of our leader, but he was just so bad at it and so intolerably annoying. Okay. I, I thought he'd be out of the picture by the time you came around. I just should have told you. I just... I didn't want you to think we were all like him. What no secrets between us. Ever again. You have my word. I pinky swear. <sighs> pinky swear. Friends for life. Your relationship with John. <laughs> <laughs> and Bruce, friends don't plant tracking gadgets on each other you've got my number i can just track your phone you're right, right let's go meet the guys now this I'll is let them know we're on our way super creepy hey! <laughs> i'm out of medicine i don't like your face and i think your father and my friend john
You've got the wrong idea. We're just having a friendly chat. You calling me a liar? You shouldn't have walked in here. <laughs> that was your first mistake. And it's gonna be your last mistake. Calm down, Willie. Let me help you out, huh? A bribe? I can't be bought off that easy, Wayne. Don't insult me. I got standards. This cash could buy you a whole lot of medicine. Oh, well, when you, when you put it that way. <laughs> Thanks, Wayne. Let's get out of here. <laughs> oh, this ah, this makes me my skin crawl a little bit. Nothing good's gonna happen. Is the Joker gonna betray cool. us? They're expecting you. Uh, Br Bruce, um, wow. Uh, <laughs> one one more thing. Yeah. You can't tell anyone. This is big. Huge. What's up? I think I'm in love. With it's it's an odd feeling. And at first, I, I I thought I had some kind of disease, but uh, no. I, I think it's love. I am so happy, John. <laughs> you deserve the best. Yeah, I'd blush if I could. You're scaring me. So mysterious. You at least got to tell me your name. She'll, you know, she'll, she'll want to introduce herself, but uh, if flaunder. you could please help me look good in front of her, I'd appreciate it. I just look Come like on. I'm drugged up. Did they? Shouldn't keep her waiting. Is it just me, folks? Like, also, does he not notice like my communicator in my ear? Did you steal this car? <laughs> Almost got it. Oh, damn it! I thought I had it. Here, uh, give me a hand with this, will you? I'm pretty sure this is how you get this thing started. Come on, come on, come on. John, really? You stole this car? I know it's kind of falling apart, but it was the only thing available, you know. Besides, the newer models, they don't start so easy without a key. There we go! Um, we're about to be punched. Don't turn around. Oh. All right, Wayne. You got my attention. Give me one good reason why I don't redecorate the windshield with your noodle. I bet a smart guy like you has some real pretty brains. Real bright. Harley. Stay out of this pudding. Grown ups are talking. Oh, she well, in the if you know who I am, then you probably know I'm more useful alive. That makes sense. Sense is so boring, though. What about money, power, and influence? They bore you too. No, those are fun. I'm <laughs> just Josh and your rich boy. Oh. See. There wasn't even a bullet in the chamber. <laughs> Oops. This is an interesting Harleen. Let's put some music on. Now, Bruce, this is the lady I was telling you about. Harley Quinn. <laughs> Isn't she a hoot? Jeez. I knew you guys would hit it off. Sure, I can take a joke. Sure. I can see the funny side. See, I told you. Bruce is a good sport. There's not even music playing. Or is you playing it in Quinnia your head? Quinnia says you're chomping at the bit to meet us. I want to get an idea why. What do you get out of rubbing shoulders with the likes of us? The agency is after us both. After the bombing, they've been sniffing all around Wayne Enterprises. We should work together to get them off our backs. Sounds to me like you just bring more heat. Bruce could be a real help to us, Harley. I feel like that was a pretty you good answer. You should have seen how he took out this guy in the bar. 
He played him like a Stradivarius. <laughs> wow, that was Do a big us word. a favor, Pud. Skip over to that bodega and get me a slushy. Right now? <laughs> Need a buck? <laughs> I got it. She gonna kill me? Oh, her face changed very quickly. Poor John. He just doesn't know who he is yet. You know, he's searching. Highly impressionable. He thinks the world of you. So I asks myself, asks, what's asks. Bruce Wayne want with a lost soul like John? To help him. It's kind of a mismatch. Raises all kinds of questions. John and I went through a lot in Arkham. He's a friend. Oh, ain't that cute. <laughs> You're sweet on little old Puddin'. Here's the thing, lover boy. Oh, wow. Guys like him don't have friends like you. She's got a real Bronx a like accent going on. You got that look in your eye, the kind that says you're trouble. And I only like trouble when I'm the one causing it. You got a good reason why I should trust you? Because I sure as hell can't see one. After all, you're a squeaky you're right clean David son of Gotham. How am I supposed to believe you won't run to the cops the first chance you get? I don't want to use this. My father used to run crime in the city. It's in my blood. Fooey. My mama was a grocer. I don't give two craps about fruits. You think that's the same? Hmm. Don't matter. You'll show me soon enough if you got what it takes. Oh, gee, thanks, Pud. We gotta go. What were you guys talking about? Your friend was just saying how much he liked you, Pud. Got a little man crush on ya. Ain't that right, Brucey? Ain't that the gist of it? It's the truth. Sure. You just made my day, Bruce. Oh, I don't like any of this. I want you this. to know the feeling's mutual. Why are you going wet? I guess it's raining. Fair enough. Oh, this is all making my skin crawl. Oh my god. That is the best damn slushy ever. No, thanks. Suck on that. I swear, it'll make your whole body shiver. Come on, put your lips on it. I ain't got cooties. Cross my heart. Oh, okay. No thanks, I'm good. Oh. Suit yourself. I'm a pretend I ain't offended. I'll try some. Mm. So did we just choose Joker over Harley? I feel like that was the okay. one of them crossroads. What's going to happen now, Mr. Moneybags? You're gonna go get Mama a little present from inside there. Wayne Enterprises. A little bird told me there's some pretty fancy hacking tech up there. Something called a phalanx key. Get it for me. I'll know you're on the level about the agency. Maybe I'll even vouch for you with the rest of the guys. What do you want with the phalanx key? Why wouldn't I want it? I hear this thing opens half the security systems in Gotham. And it's just sitting there, hidden in your lab, waiting for someone to put it to use. <laughs> What's the matter? If something like that did you exist, why, how would you figure it out? I don't want to have to splatter that pretty face. It's okay, this. Harley. Bruce and I already talked. He'll do whatever Also, that car's been following want. us. Just know Is that right? Will you do whatever I want? No. Will you jump when I say jump? Will you bring me the shiny things I ask for? Well, this is a complex task. There might be some bumps along the way. Nothing is guaranteed. Some things are. Like how fast I'll make you disappear if any of those bumps turn into trouble. God, that is like the thickest Bronx accent I've ever heard since I was out of Bronx. 
<laughs> like shit. You're on, Brucey boy. One, there's no way there we're that close to the building now. Make yourself useful and get me that phalanx key. And hurry. Mama really wants to get herself some tacos when you're done. Got this, Bruce. See, you didn't even get me close to the goddamn building. You could have at least dropped me off at the front door, damn it. Also, they have not cleaned up the giant scorch mark on the outside of the building. Come on, guys. Hey, security. What up, bruh? Uh, Mr. Wayne. How's it going, Chad? Uh, yeah, if you could please sign in on account of the attack. Sure. Of course. So, um, what brings you in? If you don't mind me asking. Is everything okay? Would you believe it? I left my wallet in my office. <laughs> <laughs> I've been there, sir. Yeah. You're all set, sir. I've been that guy. <laughs> I really have. I've been the nighttime security guy and some random person shows up and like, Hey, what's up? Oh, I just forgot my thing. It's like, well... They're robbing the place or stealing information. I don't care. You really ought to rethink your hiring practices, Bruce. Your man's lying down on the job. What did you do to him? It, is he still alive? Don't worry. A little bop on the head never kills anyone. Going up, Brucey. You do know how an elevator... Fine. I'm sorry. You know, I might have pegged you wrong. Yeah, you're not gonna good peg boy. me, period. As long as you keep up this good behavior. Give me a hard time, mm, I might have to go back and finish the job. <laughs> yeah, he wasn't a very good guard anyway. I mean, isn't he supposed to keep people out? Maybe getting knocked out will teach him a lesson. He's you fucking didn't making have to do that. I didn't have to, but I did. Now pipe down or I'll go back and finish the job. Thought you were gonna wait in the car. Now Harley figured you'd want some company. Oh yeah. Didn't want you to have to do this all by your lonesome. You don't have a problem with that, do you, Mr. Moneybags? <sighs> Fine. But no one else gets hurt. You got a strange set of priorities for someone who wants on my good side. I get it, Bruce. You're the boss. You don't turn your back on your people, even when they're useless. Wow. I have to say, Bruce, it's exhilarating to walk these hallowed halls with you. This is where the wheeling and dealing happens, the power plays, the boardroom scuffles. I can feel all that toxic energy in the walls. You think I could run a place like this one day? Like you, Bruce? I think I'd get quite a kick out of being CEO. Oh, is he going to take our spot now? If you keep your head down, work really hard, yeah, why not? First we oh, lose, pe yeah, first Penguin you takes over. real hard. <laughs> you had a rich pops who stole everything not nailed down. Oh, come on, Harley. Bruce's father works really hard at taking other people's money. You gotta give him credit for that. Your back has horrible posture, Harley. <laughs> hey, hey, pull it together, puds. All that slushy you drink has got you. <laughs> How are we going to explain this one? Oh, Bruce, well, I'm surprised to see you. And these are... Uh, <clears throat> to whom do uh, I owe friends the pleasure? From upstate. I don't believe we've met. They're fashion consultants. I figured it's time I try out a new look. Not just Bruce. We're going to revamp this whole place. Dress everyone in snazzy uniforms. <laughs> oh. Well, no one ran this by me. 
Just think, you could come into work on Monday dressed just like me. Is this some kind of joke? Do I look funny to you? Oh god. Oh. It's like I'm some kind of punchline or something. Excuse me? <laughs> what? <sighs> You're gonna let your employees sass me like that? Is this the kind of operation you run here? Your worker bees just mouth off whenever they want. Leave her alone. Yeah. She's not gonna like that. Fuck you. I ain't even gotten started. I said back off. <laughs> Your friends don't suit you, Bruce. That's not gonna end well, is it? Mm -mm. You got a firm grip, Mr. Corporation. The fuck? The kind that makes a girl go weak at the knees. Excuse me? Wanna show me what else you can do with those hands? Excuse me? We could carve out some alone time. Just you and little old me. Let's, stay Let's just stay focused on the task at hand, shall we? Bruce is right. We are people with purpose. We're here to get the phalanx. Shut your pie hole, will you, John? Oh, you see the you supposed to be the cuck in this situation? This is making my brain hurt. Oh. Wait here. I'll be right back with you. Forget it, Brucey boy. Your secret lab ain't really a secret. Cobblepot's got quite a mouth on him. I don't think he ever shut it the whole time I was working at Blackgate Prison. He told me all sorts of interesting stuff. Say, do you like chess? Work your magic. Tick-tock, what's the hold up? <sighs> Tight squeeze. You know, I think you two are the closest friends I've ever had. <sighs> this sucks. <laughs> this is just bringing me down. I present to you our secret lab. Lucius, you have seriously outdone yourself this time. <laughs> Glad you like it. Like it? I don't know this. This changes everything. It was getting a bit dodgy hiding all those batarangs in the Wayne Enterprise R&D wing. Thank you, Lucius. Come on. Now the real work starts. Mm. Hopefully there's nothing with a big bat lying around. <laughs> Somehow I was expecting more. Where's the giant crater? I thought this was where your friend went out with a bang. That was his office upstairs. Better question. Where's the phalanx key? It should be in the vault. Well, what you waiting for, sweetie? Go get it. Oh, I can walk around here. Can I look at anything? Am I just walking around? Well, nope, let's not go towards her. She's mean. <sighs> I guess. I bet there's stuff with bats on it in the vault. Oh, lock protocol vault thumbprint required Lucius Fox. That's not right. Why the lockout? Someone's been in here. What's taking so long, Bruce? It's saying it won't open without Lucius's thumbprint. And that got blown up with the rest of him, didn't it? Oh, all the dumb luck. 
You're saying we can't get it open, man. Oh, no, he's not going to like that at all. Or you. Let, let me try to find latent prints around here with my scanner. Always thinking, this guy. We're not gonna ask how he has a scanner on his phone. Dinner to celebrate Tiffany's first aid win in her prizes. Sorry you didn't make it there, Lucius. Oh, is she gonna show up? Tiffany's gonna show up. I remember when Tiffany brought that back from art class. <laughs> All right, that's a start. Tiffany's gonna show up, and we're gonna have to explain what the hell's going on to her. Getting there. Or Regina's just going to piss everyone off, one of the two. Tiffany built that rocket herself. Lucius was so proud. Uh, anything else? Nope. Hmm. One more partial print should do it. Okay, still unconscious. Hope he's not hurt too badly. Wonder if we would have went back and checked on him if uh, if he would have woke up Just and a bunch of hit the reports. alarm or something. You remember to clean out some of this junk. Not a single usable print. Oh, where the fuck did John go? There we go. Okay, this will work. But how are you gonna now get that? That's a shiny piece of metal. What's it do? I'm not even sure if it works. It's an EMP generator, Puddin. <laughs> Tell them what it does. It emits a pulse that knocks out other nearby electronic devices. <laughs> Who wouldn't want to try that? Oh, are they going to take that too? I don't like any of this. Like, at all. Please not come in the vault. This is where I keep my underwear. Even now, still finding ways to help me. Stay there. Don't touch anything. I touch what I want when I want, Brucey boy. You knew what's best for you. You'd quit giving orders and find me that key. Can we just shoot her? No, that's what I... Tiffany's in here. That's what this camera angle's for. Looking for this. Tiffany. You've never put my father in harm's way, huh? You've got a secret room full of weapons. And those maniacs you brought here. I saw on the cameras what they did to that guard. You're full of crap, Bruce Wayne. Every word out of your mouth has been a lie. You're really fucking this all up. An honest friend would have come clean at the funeral. But you just told me whatever you thought would shut me up. Tiffany, this is not what it looks like. Okay, just let me explain. Yeah, sure. Think I'll fall for your stories a second time. Are you fucking serious? Whatever else my father did, he sure as hell didn't raise a fool. I'm not sticking around for you to give me up to your psycho friends. Tiffany, don't. Hey! I remember you from the church. Well, how about that? Looks like Brucey boy's got more than just technology in his vault. Keeps his little squeezes down here, too. Just let her go, Harley. I don't think I will. Not without knowing who this vicious little sweetie pie is. 
I kind of like her, but I don't know whether to smooch her or smash her head in. You gonna tell me who she is to you? Or am I gonna have to find out the hard way? We grew up together. You could say she's family. You have no family of mine. Oof, Bruce. Your friend seems a little hot under the collar. <coughs> Certainly, as your fire, Bruce. Or should I say, your spark. You people killed my dad, didn't you? He crashed my father's funeral. And now you're here raiding his lab! I whacked a bunch of people in my time, sugar. But I don't think your old man's on my list. Then again, I sometimes lose track of the name. I can't believe you'd associate with these... with these maniacs! These killers! Oh, sweetheart. Mr. Suit and Tie ain't just an associate. He's a bad, bad man. He wants to be one of us. <laughs> ain't that right, Brucey? Ah, oh, fuck to me. Us for oh, we knew that was coming, didn't we, folks? Though so we have to pick. <sighs> so we either pick lying to Tiffany or telling. Telling Tiffany we're with them, or and you know getting in good with them, or are we <sighs> okay? Let's think about this logically. So, if we tell them we're nothing like them, the only thing that's going to happen is they're not going to trust us. We're not going to get in. Everything falls apart. Horrible death of game. <sighs> we tell Tiffany we're with them. Now we're in, and we only just have a very bad Tiffany and that could end probably badly but she's already pissed at us she's not gonna trust us anyway I think we have to go with Help it with a mutual enemy now you want to be part of the family don't you at least that's what you've been saying yeah yeah that's right I'm with you birds of a feather and all that <sighs> oh gross I'm tearing up you can be a real heartbreaker when you turn on the charm let her go. Bruce will keep her quiet, one way or another, now that he's part of the family. Ah, uh, Harley, look what I found. It was just sitting up in that vault. Oh, that's great, Pud. You get a cookie, too. Mm. Hmm. It don't look like nothing special. You've got what you wanted. Now let's just get out of here. <laughs> Load that thing up too, John. I need it. Hurry it up. <sighs> I don't like the way these games make me feel. Bruce, are you all right? I'm fine, Alfred. Oh, everything's gone to shit. I was keeping an eye on you over the security feed. Well, breaking into my own company was... unexpected. My heart stopped when I saw that mad woman coming at Tiffany. I don't blame you for saying you were one of them. It made sense to placate them, even if it meant breaking Tiffany's heart. Thanks, Alfred. That young woman is smarter than both of us, Bruce. It's only a matter of time before she puts the rest of the pieces together. You know what she's like. She won't stop digging until she gets to the truth. Maybe we should just... tell her. I've always regretted not being more honest with you about your father's life. Don't make the same mistake I did. She shouldn't be left guessing. You're right. I'll be as honest with Tiffany as I can. Better than me telling her everything, because she's uh, so pissed at her, she's just gonna scream to the rooftops. Other catastrophes. Your night watchman got a nasty lump on the head, but don't worry. He'll be fine. I've already arranged for him to get a generous payout and an extended vacation. And replace tonight's offending security camera feed with 
dummy footage. Uh, yeah, thank you. What about Regina? As for Regina, thank you. I'm afraid your fashion consultant's cover story is going to cause more problems. Your encounter there was too bizarre to be ignored. Well, after what went on, it'll be a challenge to smooth things over with her. Oh, she fucked us over last time. Coming so fast. One thing after another. You're always so good at Regina this fucked us over last right time, thing. so you think I give a fuck about her yes, this time? I suppose I will. Bruce. I know we agreed there was no better way to get to Bane. But this whole adventure with John and Harley, well, frankly, it's exhausting. Well, be careful and good luck. Thanks, Alfred. Thanks, Alfred. 2.4, and we're at 6, so this should be the last little part. We're at about an hour now, so you're aware. Those things will kill you. Consider quitting. Ah, <laughs> uh, you sound like my daughter. Fair enough. Here, you're welcome. It's information on Harleen Quinzel from Sealed Records we dug up at the coroner's office. Sorry, I just had my hand away. Harleen Quinzel's father committed suicide after decades of struggling with mental illness. Yeah, tough story. Quinzel was a devoted, successful doctor. But she couldn't save him. Must have been hard on her. The trauma of her father's death caused her breakdown, turned her into the monster she is today. Now, I know what she's done, but I can't help but feel a little sorry for her. It's gotta be rough on a person, going through all that. Yeah. The loss of a loved one can do that. I'd have to imagine it would. Gordon, you're dismissed. This is still my goddamn station house. He's forgetting I'm the one who can make or break his career right now. You only remind me every other minute. Clearly, I need a better method of getting the message across. You're both behaving like children. <laughs> Watch your tone, Batman. For what? You'll put him on timeout? I've been lenient with you so far, but don't push me. That didn't help. She's got some kind of leverage on you, doesn't she? If she's jammed you up somehow, just say the word. I'll appeal to the mayor, the governor, whatever it takes to get her off your back. I'll do whatever I can to help you. She knows who I am, Jim. Oh, yeah? Well, so do I. You're Batman. Uh -huh. That's all you ever have to be. That's all Gotham needs you to be. And you, if you're threatening to take that away, you should be ashamed of yourself. I don't want to hear it. Bye, Jim. Wait, did he take that as a bad thing? Just supposed to come to Gotham, put the chains on Riddler and his gang, and get the hell out. I'm just saying, this city gets under your skin. Fast. Know what I mean? Best laid plans and all that. You didn't choose this profession because it's easy. You do the job, or you don't. You're absolutely right. I guess you locals see it differently. Agent of Esther. She fought to get on this assignment, you know? Wanted to see her old neighborhood. Wanted to see you. Her hometown hero. She wanted to impress you. She admires what you do for the people of this city. Your respect is important to her. She certainly succeeded on that front. She's one of my best. Still, wanting to impress you, it's the same thing that made her move too fast on Riddler. Now there's a lesson learned. I so, still don't like you. Wayne Enterprises. Heard you made some new friends. You're having me followed. Thanks to you, 
These very bad people have an EMP and a key that'll open every lock I would want to you keep said to shut. They're clearly planning something. The stakes are too high to leave anything to chance. I like how it keeps You know, I actually considered asking you to infiltrate Riddler's gang. Before everything blew up, I knew I could count on you to get me close to them. Close to Bane. You're good at this. Seems like you've already won Harley Quinn's trust. What you saw was just a test. An operation like theirs requires someone with your resources. As long as you don't blow it, they're gonna want to keep Bruce Wayne around until they take him for all they can. Get them away from their base of operations. Somewhere, they'll be exposed. When they're all together, out in the open, contact me. I'll be standing by, ready to ambush. We'll take them down when they're at their most vulnerable. Sound good? They'll never know what hit them. Oh, shit. Okay, I was reading those things and it hit me. Uh, the one is no one gets killed and the other is Lupin Gordon. So we can other... We're going to go with Lupin Gordon. You need to involve Gordon. Don't tell me how to run my operation. You know what? His Fuck you. These people know this city better than anyone. And they have their hands filled with other priorities right now. She'll remember that. That's fine. Batman. If it gets bad for you, just remember. We're out here. When you're in deep like this, you need friends. Let's say everything goes pear-shaped, and you get stuck in there longer than you'd like. Then what's right, what's wrong, it all gets blurry. And guess what? That's okay. Because you're going to have to do some blurry things that you are not proud of before this is done. You hear me? That's just how these kinds of operations go down. I created Batman to strike fear into criminals. Stick true to who we are. One. Batman's not the one rubbing shoulders with them at the moment. You should think about which one Gotham really needs right now. Damn. You're in. Corner of finger and eight, Al, 18. I'm in. Just. Don't stay embedded any longer than necessary. I'll be in and out, Alfred. Just long enough to figure out their plans. Oh, this is where it'll end. Bruce. Stay safe. You know these games. They're going to end us on some cliffhanger, horrible, horrible death thing. Ooh, hey, nice micro hack going on. All right. Here we go. Hey, there's a guy behind you. Eh. Wow. Getting jumped in apparently. Hit me so hard, threw me into a loading screen. Old five points. Hey now, welcome to our little hideaway and home away from home. The end of the line. We're happy to have you. Really? Thanks, John. You said you'd kill him after you got what you needed. So what? Ain't a girl allowed to change her mind? Could someone? Get me out of these handcuffs, please. Tell me why I shouldn't kill you. What I have is influence, and that is worth a lot. <laughs> Spoken like a man who has never had to do hard work. <laughs> who the hell wants to do hard work? I bring us back the transport and the arms we require. You, you bring back a worthless aristocrat. We don't need his money. We have what we need to finish this. Thanks to me. He ain't what would worthless, if I him? you overgrown bicep. He already got us an EMP device and the phalanx key. I'll betcha I can find a use for him. I do not care how much these two swoon over you, Wayne. We don't want you here, and we don't need you here. Ah. Whoopsie. What the hell? John, <laughs> turn it off! Turn it off! Now! Can you do something about this? It's freezing. Freezes. What have you done? You need to uncover me. 
Don't screw this up. You fool! I can turn it off. Make it stop, or I will seal you both in ice! I swear, if you don't get that turn electricity off. back on immediately, turn I'll off. send you to a frozen uh, hell. Turn off. Uh, is there an actual sequence for this? Uh, 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 um. Oh, up here. Uh, d down here. Uh, first schematic. Uh, that green. Uh, match the, uh, that green, that red, that... Okay, that needs to be red. I just now figured out what the fuck I'm doing. I'm sorry. <laughs> the, you gotta match the schematic on the, on the right there with the colors. There, red, 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 green. Oh. Well, at least we know that it works. Nice goggles. I must check on Nora. See how she is. You may have impressed these two, but I haven't made up my mind about crushing your skull. Thanks. Fair enough. Everyone back to work. There's still a lot to get done. Who put you in charge? Somebody has to give the orders. Where the hell is that guy? <laughs> Those two guys, their job is shutting that door. That was a nice job before. What if, did Joker just Go do that on purpose? I think Joker did that on purpose. Why is Freeze looped in? Why are they looping in Freeze? They better have Nora on, like, lockdown. Listen, Bruce. I just want to clear the air a little. You showed me you were loyal back at your office. Did everything I asked, despite all the trouble I gave you. You probably noticed I like to stir things up. It's a bad habit, and... Well, it's made me more enemies than friends. I want to say hey, her degree's I'm on the sorry background. for messing with your people. Your employees. I know they probably mean a lot to you. Thank you, Harley. Your apology means a lot. Really? Oh. You probably think I'm a terrible person, but I want you to understand. You've seen these animals I work with. In my business, you let your guard down for a second, you get torn to shreds. I can only imagine. If I'm always pushing buttons, it's to keep people off balance, you know? Keep them guessing my next move. Keep the real me hidden. I Respect hope you ain't gonna judge me for it. No. To be honest, I've been at it so long I don't even notice I'm doing it. It's just a part of who I am. I'll be honest, Harley, I wasn't sure what to make of you. I'm impressed. I'm gonna take that as a compliment. Eh, that's but don't weird. push your luck. Her gloves are like you half off. You ain't like these others. Bane's a powder keg. Freeze. <laughs> well, you saw Freeze. John's sweet. And believe me, he's got heaps of potential. But he's still a growing boy. You, though, you got your head screwed on right. You're reasonable. I can work with reasonable. We're pulling a job. Tonight, I want you to be a part of it. You already showed you know how to use that EMP better than any of these other clowns. I want you to come with. I'm in. Just tell me what to do. That's what I wanted to hear. Hmm. All will be revealed eventually. Using that EMP, though, that's going to make tonight's job a whole lot less messy. And that no-neck asshat Bane, he loves making a mess. <laughs> People getting killed just makes his day. If you're gonna come with, you gotta convince the others. Convince them? It's a real pain in the ass sometimes, but you need a majority opinion for anything big. And bringing you along, well, you got some persuading to do. Let me know how I can help. So what's the deal with Freeze? He's... unique. <laughs> you mean why he's blue and wrapped up in machinery? Accident in the lab. Here's the thing about Freeze. Only thing he gives two hoots about is his wife. He gave up everything to try and save her when she got sick. And I mean everything. Job, health, 
soul, the whole shebang. She's dead? Frozen's death keeps her on ice in the next room while he searches for a cure. Ain't that just kooky? I mean, it explains why he flipped when the EMP went off. But seriously, who does that? I don't know. Sounds pretty romantic to me. Bruce, you big softy. <laughs> Well, out of the three options, that was that the best way. one. It's just made him into such an angry person. You know? It's tearing him up inside. Talking about his wife is the only way to get Freeze to pay attention to you. But watch yourself. His attention ain't always a good thing. I get the feeling Bane doesn't like me very much. That knucklehead respects strength and loyalty. Show me you got those. And he'll come around. He's a man's man. I don't got much time for all that burly machismo, but sit him down for a beer or something. He'll hear what you gotta say. He may kill you when you're done, but at least he'll listen. Oh, why would we bring up... I'll go talk to the others. See what I can do. Why would we bring up her father? I've got faith in you, handsome. She has no reason for us to know about her father. I, yeah, we're not bringing that up. We're not opening that can of worms. We've just got her on our side. Spirit of unity? Not really what I'm sensing from this group. I thought that might tell us where the hell we are. And yeah, let's go try talking to Freeze. Never mind. <laughs> Just love the walking around mechanics. would Harley need with an EMP? I can't risk tampering with it. Oh, I was gonna look at the map. I heard about your wife, and I... <laughs> Hear me out. I might be able to help. What do you mean? Oh, I like how they put his... You'll answer with... me if you're smart, and understand the concept of self-preservation. I know pain. What it's like to lose a loved one. I can't imagine anyone knowing anything like what I've experienced. But I do know of your family tragedy. Perhaps you may know what it's like. What is what if you get thing caught? Of? Sent to prison. What happens to your wife then? What do you propose? I own technology companies, Victor. Big ones. You could house and protect her. Continue your research to cure her. Why? Why would you do this? You're well, genius. I'm not doing it for nothing. I expect a full return on my investment. <laughs> Practical. I respect that. I'll talk to Bane. Make sure he thinks you're on the level. You have my word. I may have misjudged you. Any tips on handling Bane? I don't know. Go talk to him. <laughs> Thanks, Victor. Good luck. Where's beer? Can I grab beer? Okay, now originally. What are they planning to do? I don't have time to sort through all this. Not with them watching me. Well, Victor was easy. I love the down the stairs mechanic. Sorry, I was reading the a notification from Batman the Telltale series <laughs> popped up letting me know that this is out. Okay, perfect. Right. How do we get over there? What is this? Oh, this Joker's little hut. Oh, this Hey buddy! It's always so good to see you. Like so good. Always good to see you, John. I've been wanting to say, Bruce, thanks for helping me out before, and your office, you know, making me look good. 
I actually thought you'd be mad about what happened before at Wayne Enterprises. You know, Harley really seemed to be... Not at all. Harley and I talked and talked about how lame you are. <laughs> it was by far the longest we've ever talked without her losing interest. It was great. <laughs> I should have known. I like right that he's the one head over here. Everything would work out with her. Great. That's an interesting twist. I like it. Harley wants me to try to get in good with Bane and Freeze. I think you're well on your way to doing just that. And I've been doing, you know, what I can to uh, help, too. You didn't catch it? You turn. <laughs> Looked like Bane might kill you. I set off that EMP, you know. I told you. Distraction. Told you. Thought it might give you a chance to show off your technical skills in front of Freeze. That was intentional? <laughs> John, how did you manage to do that? No Bane was going to kill you? Seemed like a safe bet. <laughs> no, no, Lucius would have put safeguards on the EMP to keep you from doing exactly what you did. Then I guess we both got really lucky. Hmm. And wouldn't you know it, you nailed it. Interesting. You already know I like you, Bruce. You better get cracking on getting those other guys to like you, too. I wonder what so that means. I have to watch what happens if they don't. Can I take some of those beers? You have a, two, a case of beer there. Can I grab a few of those? Yes. Prisca. Now, Bane loves that beer. I bought some for when I need to talk to him. He's scarier than anybody in Arkham. Thanks, John. Can I grab myself a beer? Bye, John. Oh, why is... I like how that needed a loading screen. Okay. Good thing I went over there. Wow, oh, this will definitely help. I want propane tanks. Thought you looked thirsty. Didn't even crack the tank. Please, come. Oh, okay. Riddler, he bombed your building and killed your friend. Someone did that to me. I bombed their building, kill their friend. As Riddler's friend, I have to know. Are you here for payback? Did you come for revenge? Answer me, or I will break you in half. The payback I want is with the agency. They wronged me, and now I want to make it right. I'm sure you understand. Riddler studied this Waller woman, profiled her. She is arrogant, presumptuous, and she won't see what we have planned coming. If you want to get back at the agency, we at least have that in common. In this line of work, one cannot be too careful. Trust has been the hardest thing to find, especially after Riddler's death. It's a nice yes. voice actor. Men you can trust, so hard to find. He was with my crew at the police arsenal. Bane! The prisoner he was supposed to be guarding got away. And yet he doesn't have a scratch on him. This is crazy! I suspect we have a traitor among us. One begins to smell a rat after Riddler's murder and that prisoner getting away. Loyalty is all that we have. But... There can be no trust unless I can believe that you are who you say you are and that you are really willing to do all that you claim. Only one of you walks out of here. You know me. The sooner one of you picks up that pipe and bashes the other's head, the sooner we get this over with. Okay. Fine. I'll prove it. Can I just break his legs? You showed him mercy. 
That was a mistake. Take him somewhere. The package is moving. What's going on? The job we've been getting ready for. It's happening. Good. I'm ready. Not so fast, the money bags. You're not in the pact. Not yet. Not till everyone votes. What do you say, boys? Bruce Wayne. He in? Or out? The aristocrat likes the backbone to dirty his hands. Out. Oh, fuck. There may be more to Wayne than first appeared. He can be trusted. In. Bruce is strong and smart and handsome. <laughs> like, super handsome. It's nuts, you guys. And Jesus. Where was I going with this? Right, right. I vote in. Well, aren't you, Mr. Popular? We got a majority, folks. Bruce is in. You've earned a well, ticket to ride, pal. I feel okay. Make sure that EMP shielding is on those APCs. I don't need any surprises. Bru or to Time impress to Bane would have been a package. whole lot of shit. Remember, when we work together, no one can stop us. When we work together, the world can be ours. Yeah, that rousing speech to three people. Let's go. Good job. Somebody grab that thing. It's important. Didn't you just say you grab the MP? Let's go. Hit him with the hind. Interesting. Oh, 2.5. Enemy, or behind enemy lines. Wait, are we gonna play another one? Oh, wow. It's been on for 87 minutes now. Wayne, we are close. Make your device ready. Will do. Oop. Oh, I was... I was flying. EMP primed and ready to go. Harley. Yeah, what? We have almost reached the target vehicle. Uh-huh. No. You are providing our escape. Yeah. Waller. On the move with targets. Track this signal. Get your people here now. We got did... your signal locked. Cavalry is on the way. How did no one see that? Also, now I like how I didn't pick this. the call. Her. Oh shit. Gonna activate the EMP, it'll tear off the uh the tracking. Wait, what in the I gotta say, Bruce, now that we're actually here and it's really happening, I'm feeling some butterflies in my stomach. We have an obstruction ahead, both lanes, armored vehicles, surface weapons at the ready. Do not engage. Now, Wayne, do it. Okay. Oh, their guns are gonna turn off. What was the hell is going on? HQ, do you copy? My gun, it's fried. All comms are down. Well, let's pull out a different gun. Move! Carry the torch, Mr. Suit. Stay sharp. Why am I carrying a thing? Secure the vehicle. My job is literally just to carry a torch. Stay down. All right, everyone on the ground now. Your place is on the perimeter. Keep yeah, yeah. Freeze. Open the door. <laughs> Everyone, stay sharp and keep order. Allow no sudden moves and no talk. Strike it. Go on, quickly. You're wondering what's in there. Find out for yourself. <laughs> Back off, or I'll shoot. No, no, no! Don't. Break it off! We don't have time for this. We're not done here, Wayne. Oh, wow. That pissed him off. I will not turn my back on him. 
I'll leave this clean up to you, but hurry. Men, seize the cargo. Get out of here! Waller, where are you? He's gonna be dead. Duh. EMP. About. The package. Let them have it. It's not worth my agent's lives. You can't be serious. You were supposed to be here. No! That was my ride! Bring out the artillery and disable their vehicles! Sorry, I'm sorry. Damn it. We can fix this all later. For now, just move it. I Wall her out. Gotta get out of here. I don't wanna hurt ya. But I will blow your heads off if you make me. Eat concrete! Lights out! So sorry. Put out that fire! Whack them all with their heads. It's a warrior's death. Uh, head off. Harley. Brucey, come join the fun. <laughs> Keep your arms and legs inside the ride. Oh fuck! I don't know why I picked Harley over Bane. Picked two to get out of there. Interesting. So we pissed off Freeze and we left. We left Bane there. We just. Oh god. So we physically didn't kill anyone, but we definitely let a few of those guys die. That that definitely happened. Fuck me. Nice work back there, Brucey boy. You really know how to show a girl a good time. Have your fun now. Oof, the Iceman bummeth. If Bane survives, you'll make us all pay for abandoning him. Bane will survive, and he won't let this slip. Nice, probably having a ball. Cracking skulls. We did what we had to do. We retrieved the package, and Harley drove off to make sure we kept it. You tell him. You're all welcome. All right. We got the package. Be grateful you're around to see it. What is it? Is she going to use the phalanx key to open it? <laughs> Intrigued, Brucey? Want to know what's inside? Go on. It's going to be a bat suit. Mark my words, at 94.37 on this, uh, it's going to be a bat suit. 100 bucks. Here we go. Here we go. It's going to be a bat suit. Oh. That is not what I figured. A corpse? Whew. I thought he stank when he was alive. You really put us through a lot of trouble, Mr. Smarty Pants. Getting yourself killed like that. She not dead. We needed you for the next stage. 
I've got what you need. For the right price. Oh, didn't see that coming. Hey, Bruce. Oh, you know, that's a cliffhanger, but that's not as bad as I thought it was going to be. Shit. Um, you left Harley feeling happy. She was annoyed that you made her apologize to Rhea. She felt satisfied. She was thrilled. Okay. Oh, you 90 did that. Wow, content. Wow, that one really broke out the other two. Um, John was fished uh, happy. We kept John happy the whole time. Um, we let us and a lot of people left Gordon worried. Uh, a lot of blue there. A lot of blue. Um, you and a hundred percent of people left Alfred content. Everyone. No one told Alfred to fuck off. Good job, everyone. You, wow. He didn't believe, she didn't believe you when he said it wasn't what it looked like and she was horrified to hear. Yeah, I, I, yeah. Um, did you get Tr Tiffany to hand over the phalanx? About half and half. Um, did he call Gordon? A lot of people called Gordon. Right call, in my opinion. Did you pay Willie off or let it go to resolve? You and 46% of people called Willie with a drink. Um, took a look and he drew a knife on. Players took Willie down violently when he pulled the knife on them. Interesting. Um, about half and half was there. Did a lot of people pinky swear? Few people didn't. Well, that was cool. Here we go. Next time. Oh, that's right, we don't get next times on it when they come out like this. Ah, oh, that's sad. Well, as always, let's just see the episodes. What is the next one? Fractured Mask. Kind of gave away that uh, plot device here at the. with this. Kind of gave away the whole her coming back. Because they had that silhouette earlier. But, uh, yeah, it'll probably be another month before we get the uh, next installment, I suppose. Um, but, we'll more than likely play it as long as I can. Um, enjoying it. Wish they were more back to back, but uh, this one didn't end on all that bad. I felt like we, we made a lot of right choices on this one. Few people died, but sometimes just can't avoid it. As always, um, I'm Jay Daisy with the Jay Daisy Gaming Channel. I'll s gladly see you in the next one. We're all in this one together.